Well, it's a beautiful day to be out on the water on the central coast. Pretty strong wave activity out there, though, in areas like Avila Beach. This was a view from our Surfline camera earlier today. Let's take a look at some of the photos you guys sent us using hashtag B on KSBY. This is Karen's view over Arroyo Grande. Here's a nice shot of Morro Bay this morning. We'll take your photos on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. Current temperatures now 59 degrees in Paso Robles, 54 in San Luis Obispo, 56 in Santa Maria, 53 in Vandenberg, and 66 in Santa Barbara. So this afternoon, we already started to see some really strong wind activity in Santa Barbara County. Santa Maria Airport seeing gusts around 33 miles per hour today, 46 mile power gusts recorded in Gaviota and Refugio, and almost 40 mile power gusts recorded in the San Marcos Pass. Things are expected to get even stronger later this evening, and we are tracking a wind advisory now currently in place for Santa Barbara County South Coast. Wind speeds right now 16 miles per hour in Paso Robles, 23 miles per hour in San Luis Obispo, 24 in Santa Maria, 26 in Vandenberg and 13 mile per hour winds in Santa Barbara. So you'll see in our wind forecast wind activity really amping up as we're heading into later this evening. Here's a look at 1 a.m. Sunday, 26 mile per hour sustained winds in Santa Barbara. You can see these colors all lighting up around here. This is the mountain area of Santa Barbara County where gusts could potentially be 30 to 45 miles per hour. Some areas could see gusts up to 50 miles per hour tonight going into tomorrow morning. Now as we advance into 8 a.m. Sunday, still 27 mile per hour sustained winds in Santa Barbara compared to just 11 miles per hour in Paso Robles, 6 miles per hour in San Luis Obispo and 7 miles per hour in Santa Maria. Oh, well, there's a good chance that some wind advisories will be extending into tomorrow afternoon, both on land and out on the water as well. So we're tracking again that wind advisory that's covering the mountain areas of Santa Barbara County and the Santa Barbara County South Coast goes into tomorrow morning. Really strong winds anticipated in the foothill areas and also around the Montecito Hills area as well. But out on the water, another story entirely a gale watch now going into place tomorrow afternoon into late Sunday night potentials for combined seas 9 to 11 feet because of those really strong wind gusts. That high surf advisory is expected to expire later this evening. Still out there though dangerous rip currents, so do keep that in mind if you're planning on heading out to the beach tomorrow. Plenty of sunshine tomorrow if you are planning on heading out to the beach. No real cloud coverage making its way towards the central coast at least through Sunday. Potentials for some clouds to return for some areas on Monday, but we are expecting things to be sunny and dry over the next few days and to get a lot warmer as well. So forecast for tomorrow, 67 degrees for your high in Paso Robles, 66 in San Luis Obispo, 63 in Santa Maria, 64 in Lompoc, and 71 for your high tomorrow in Santa Barbara. Down the coast in Carpinteria, 64 degrees, 66 in Santa Inez in Los Alamos. In Nepoa, we're looking at 65 degrees, 65 in Rio Grande, and 64 in Pismo Beach. And in northern San Luis Obispo County in Avila Beach, 62 degrees, 60 in Morro Bay, and 58 in Cayucas. So check out this extended forecast. You'll see a warming trend is on the way. Many areas getting back into the low 70s by Tuesday. You can always see our 10-day forecast on our app in the App Store.